Well, they tell me it's actually a lot quieter than they expected. Let me show you 460, a major road here in Lynchburg. You could tell not a lot of cars are out, and it's a time of day when it's usually really packed with Liberty University right there. Lynchburg's Department of Emergency Management said it's getting fewer calls than expected since people are staying off the roads. In fact, dispatchers say they were pretty quiet for a majority of the day. However, the department did plan ahead days before and brought in more staff just in case. Dispatchers packed a bag if they have to stay overnight or can't get back home. To prepare here, I mean, I make sure, like I said, my family is stocked with food and water and, and flashlights here. Um, I brought some extra clothes, uh, some chargers in case we were to lose power at home. I can make sure some of my devices are charged. For the most part, the major roads aren't that bad, but you do have to drive slow since there are some slushy and icy patches. Now, the snow kind of stopped for just a little bit. You could still see a little bit just going across the camera, uh, but you know, the wind is pretty strong right now, and if you did have some travel plans, I'm sure that some of you had to stay at home or had to get some hotels because Lynchburg's at the Lynchburg Airport, all flights are canceled for today. In Lynchburg, Ananda Rochita, WSL West 10. One of the biggest concerns, thank you, Ananda, biggest concerns during this winter whiteout is road conditions. WSLS 10's Aaron Brookshire joins us.